Uh, this is my personal project. It's about the phosphorescence decay of strontium aluminate relative to its current temperature. This is my setup and it conducts, it, it is made of three components, the LDR, the laser, and the heater. It syncs well and it performs data analysis and uh, data acquisition. The reason why I chose this is because I have a passion for science. I joined the Science Academy to be able to express this interest and through the Science Academy I was able to get, get really important feedback from teachers such as Mr. Eden. Um, I learned to build, build circuits in this personal project, how to automate, uh, automate processes and stabilize heat. I learned to use relays, power supplies, thermocouplers, vacuums, and other things. I would like to thank Mr. Eden Steven, the head of Science Academy of SPH, for assisting me in this project, giving me valuable feedback. Whoa. Uh, throughout this project, I have been enlightened in many ver various fields such as computer science and material science. And through the Science Academy, I have learned many things including collaborating with other people and uh, learning how to read and write research papers. So Jason was the youngest participant at the conference. It was quite a special and touching moment. We can see all the professors and scientists really appreciate what Jason has achieved. They are fully supportive of his efforts. Scientific publication is an act of adding scientific facts to the global bank of knowledge around the world. Manuscripts are evaluated by real experts in the field, professors and scientists, to ensure the highest quality of science is maintained. During the past three years, I have studied how computer science can be used to advance a variety of technologies and industries. In a few months, I will finish my high school career and I will continue to pursue computer science at a university level where I will be able to apply the research skills I have gained. All the best, Jason. Congratulations again. Well done.